I was just doing it just to get my creative juices out. And if people like it, I love it. Rapper Nucci started these front porch freestyles back in 2017, but it was nothing like the full scale production it's grown into. It was just me and my phone. I was recording myself just rapping. He was signed to Atlantic Records at the time, but wasn't happy and needed some place to vent. He took it to his front porch. Well, I got to do something to show people that I'm good at this. Now he has some of the biggest names in hip hop and go-go gracing his makeshift stage, complete with a live band. Think NPR's tiny desk, but on the front steps of his home instead. From Miss Kim, lead singer of Rare Essence, to Big G from Backyard Band, and DC's DJ Alize. This is just something totally different, just to get on somebody's front porch. I mean, and the neighbors not complain, hey. get out and have a good time. And it's just a breath of fresh air just to see the Go-Go collab, collabing with the hip hop side of Washington, D.C., the DMV, just showing what we can all do as a collective group together. People keep telling me like it's revitalizing the city. But it's also putting Go-Go, D.C.'s official music, on the international map thanks to the wide reach social media has. Like a lot of comments I'm reading, people from Louisiana, people from Spain and Australia, and they talking about, I like go-go, like, I'm like, whoa, like, I, that, wasn't my, that wasn't my expectation, but I, I love it. What started as a way to showcase his own talent has now turned into an international movement. What we did over here kind of brought it back. Not to say it went anywhere, because people still go going, but I just, just from my point of view, I see a lot more go-go love these days. Yeah. Yeah. Front porch.